Hello YouTube uh, modeling community. Mike here, Mike's Miniature Motors. Just want to do a quick bench update uh, of what I've been working on. Missed y'all last weekend with Christmas, just all the, you know, the Christmas stuff going on. Uh, so happy belated Merry Christmas. I put Merry Christmas in most of the comments, but uh, if I missed anybody, uh, sorry about that. And uh, Merry uh, belated Christmas, whatever you might want to say. Uh, Happy New Year's to all y'all. Um, hopefully, if y'all have plans tonight, y'all be safe, uh, be smart. Um, anyway, Torino. Uh, just about ready to start doing all the small stuff, the mirrors, uh, so on and so forth. Um, I went to go wax it this morning in my my uh, rear window. You know, I was rubbing on it a little bit and uh, fell in, so... Kind of a bummer, so I got to take it all back apart and uh, glue that back in. Uh, so kind of a hard sink on that. Nope, shaking it. I don't know if you hear the little noise, but uh, I can see the rear view mirror fell off also. Uh, anyway, so that's where that's at. Uh, I've got all the little fiddly bits um, pinned. Really, really neat, man. They put a... They go on the lower rocker panels. They say 429 on them. I don't know if you can see in the camera. It's not going to focus. Put a wash in both of them. There's one for each side of the body. But I got those pinned. Uh, door handles are pinned. I've, I've got them on here touched up with the uh, Malto this morning. Sitting on my bench. Mirrors are over here. They're pinned. Ready to go together. Um, 918. I've polished down to the, uh, the 4000. It's got dust on it. But, uh, so that's kind of coming along halfway there. Got the six and the eight left. Uh, for the longest time, I was on the fence about whether I was going to put any carbon fiber on here. You know, the McLaren 570 kind of wore me out a little bit. But, uh, uh, anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Uh, so I've got my masks already made for that. Sitting on a piece of glass that just happens to be underneath the camera stand. So, um, I'm not going to... I mean, y'all don't really care to see the pieces of masking tape cut to the to the uh, diffuser. Um, Moto Guzzi. Uh, I've had this painted for probably 15, maybe 20 years, guys. I don't know if the camera's picking up on it, the reflection. But uh, I know this is, uh, to me, a gunmetal. I'm not sure what yellow this is. I think maybe a Krylon or maybe even a Pactra. Uh, but I know it's not to me because I've tried matching this piece up with a uh, regular yellow and chrome yellow and it doesn't come close <clears throat> so anyway the clear you would figure the yellow would uh you know it's had more than a decade to cure or whatever but the uh, to me a clear as you can see uh well i don't know if you can see it anyway i have a reaction in here if you can't see it there's a small crazing all throughout here um uh, got most of the uh the front forks, that's you've seen the wheels, you saw it last time. Uh, front fork stuff, and I've, there's a whole bunch of other little pieces. Um, everything's all painted and ready to go, but uh, I don't know if you can see the crazing on there or not. Uh, so until this is done, I can't put the forks together. Um, that's it as far as plastic goes. Uh, some of y'all been showing your 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 Christmas haul. Um, my oldest got me this. He knows that, uh, you know, I can pretty much go out and get whatever plastic kits I want. Um, but uh, this is wood, guys. It's a uh, uh, company's called Handcraft. There's the box it came in. Six uh, sheets of wood. Everything's pre-cut. Uh, really, really neat. I'm going to move my camera. Show you the instructions it's really involved I, I didn't count the pieces but uh i have to move it even farther back there's this side this side and uh yeah there's that even even more so it's it's really pretty involved uh really really neat it's been a lot of fun building uh kind of a nice challenge something totally different um uh, can't wait to finish it i'm gonna send a pic and uh Text it to him, letting him know I'm done. It was a lot, of, like I said, it was a lot of fun. Um, let me move the Torino.
Got this from my brother-in-law. This uh, Harley. I don't know what it is. If it's Franklin Mint, Danbury Mint. Uh, I think it's pretty funny if you can see the uh, the long horns on there. My my uh, son is an Aggie, so I can't wait to put this on the K on the uh, on the shelf when he comes over and he'll be like, "What's that?" Because uh, you know he bleeds maroon, not uh, burnt orange. So that was really cool. Really nice of my brother-in-law to do that. <clears throat> I got uh, two of the Schwinn bikes, one in red, one molded in yellow. Uh, my best friend, I've known him since middle school, uh, still has his. Uh, he has a yellow one. It's hanging from his uh, ceiling in his garage, uh, pretty much intact. Of course, worn as uh, you would expect uh anything like that to be uh you know it was really really uh ridden a lot but uh really cool that he still has it put that back up there um i got two of these um you know i've been kind of getting into die cast lately um obviously nobody makes the f8 or uh this is actually the uh uh the sf90 um if you want to say the souped up version of the f8 so, uh, you know, I got that because Ferrari is my favorite marquee. So I got two of those. Um, I got a bunch of paints. Uh, I'm not going to show you those. But uh, this is what I'm probably the happiest about is uh, or most excited about. I don't know which one I want to start on first. Got the Alpha uh, Pista. And I got the... Uh, 720 i've seen two of these built online i, I, I forget uh, who's built them but uh um i wish i would have looked that up but uh that's what really set me over the top i'm really really wanting it i was on the fence for the longest time and i uh, finally got it so uh anyway guys that's about it again uh happy new year's i'm sure there's something that i forgot oh and you know i got some uh two motors and two figures from Iceman Collections, but uh, those are put away in the drawer already, so I'm not going to go dig those out. But anyway, guys, again, y'all have a happy New Year's, and uh, take care. Thank you to all my subscribers, new and old. Uh, hit like if you like the video. If you have any questions, comments, uh, feel free to write. I try to respond as quickly as I can, and uh, that's about it, guys. All right, y'all take care. Happy New Year's. Bye-bye.